Hey guys, it's Veda, day 23. So I just finished um, playing Star Wars Force Unleashed 2 today. Just beat the game. For one, I'd like to say, that game is way too short. Like, the first game was... The first game was kind of short too, but it was still longer than the second one. I was somewhat disappointed how, like, soon the game was over. Like, I really was like, really? Is this, like, the last level? Like, I mean, it was ridiculous. But yeah. Um, a couple things I'd like to say about the game. Though I really like the story. Like, I mean, across both games, I like the story. I thought it was very creative, and I liked how they kind of, like, tied it into the, into the stories of the movies. Um, the thing I didn't really like as much about the second one was that it seemed like I was constantly in, like, cutscenes. It seemed like I was watching a scene, like, every freaking five minutes. And I was like, man, there's, like, as many cutscenes as there is, like, actual gameplay. And a lot of, like, the quick time events where you're hitting the buttons. So I think that also kind of, like, added to the feeling like I was watching it more than playing it. Um, yeah. I will say, I really did like the uh, combat a lot more in this game. Like, I really like the dual wielding lightsabers. Though, the combat was somewhat more simplified in the second game than it was in the first one. Like, I mean, there were combos in the first one, whereas, like, in the second one, there's, like, a fair bit of, like, button mashing. You're just pretty much, like, I'm playing it on the 360. You just sit there and play it, hit, like, the X button a whole bunch. And then you're like, uh, maybe throw in, like, a Y or a B every once in a while. But it kind of doesn't really matter when you hit those buttons. Whereas, like, in the first one, there were predetermined combos. And also, I like the leveling system more in the first one because it was like you could level up different stats, like how much health you did, how quick your health, how much health you have, how quick your health regrows, how quick your force regrows, how much force you have, how much force you use during like using the force. And I don't know, all that sort of thing. There's a lot more of like customization in the first one. Whereas in the second one, it's like you have the force powers and you can upgrade the force powers, but that's kind of it. Though I do like that they allow you to do the Jedi mind trick in the uh, second game. Like, I really wanted to use that during, like, the main story of the first game. But, yeah, whatever. I don't know. Overall, I would say... I really liked the second game, though it was definitely way too short, and there was a fair amount of cutscenes that kind of made it feel like I was watching it instead of playing it, but, you know, whatever. It's still a pretty cool game. Uh, I would suggest it to anyone who's played the first one, or anyone who's a fan of Star Wars in general. I don't know, it's always fun playing a Jedi, but... Yeah. Guess that's it for today. Beta day twenty three. Alright, later.